hello everyone in this microsoft excel video we are going to see that how can you work with a very common problem in microsoft excel that is the auto saving and the recovery options what happens if you accidentally close the file or your microsoft excel crashes while you are working on it and you have not saved your progress so microsoft excel creates a backup of your file for yourself and you can just use that backup and auto save the file or recover the file anytime you want. Without any further ado, let's see how can we get that file and where can we get that file. Okay, so let's go to the file option in Microsoft Excel. You might want to go to this options here. This will bring up this kind of a dialog box. In this, you need to go to the save button. Now here is all the information that is available related to saving the workbooks, whether Microsoft Excel has auto saved them or if you have manually saved them. So first of all is in which format you want to save the files. So Excel workbook is the format. Here you can set the duration where you want Microsoft Excel to automatically recover the information every uh, duration of minutes so by default it's set to 10 if you are working very frequently or your Microsoft Excel you think is gonna crash frequently you can decrease or increase look uh, this duration as per your choice now this option is very important and make sure it is always checked that is that you need to keep the last auto saved version even if you close without saving so that means that whatever the version that was auto saved by microsoft excel you've got to keep that version even if you have um, closed the excel sheet and have not saved the changes so this is kind of an important thing make sure it is checked this is the auto recovery file location that means where your files will go once you have saved them Okay, so this is where you will get all your files. What you can do is just copy this whole path, bring up this folder icon and here just paste this path. Okay, so let's just use control V and press enter. So here is where you will get all of your Excel files that would be saved. Okay, so if Excel has auto saved any of those files or auto recovered the files which you have accidentally closed. Uh, then we have this um, options these different options are available which you can change as per your choice but the main thing is the location for auto recovery which is this so that's all for this video and thanks for watching